Okay, here's another vehicle from the 2017 Hot Wheels D case. And this is the Toyota Off Road Truck. And uh, it's also been called the Toyota Baja Truck. But um, this one is uh, this is the regular version of this truck. And this truck is also used for the Super Treasure Hunt for the D case which although it's not a bad looking treasure hunt uh, or a super treasure hunt I should say I am a little bit disappointed that they chose this model as the super uh, for this case because we had just seen it as the super treasure hunt in 2015 and uh, that was one of the later ones in 2015 so that means it's barely been over a year uh, since we have seen this one featured as a super treasure hunt. I think it's a little too soon to be bringing it back. There's a lot of great models out there uh, that have never been a super treasure hunt. So really would have liked to have seen them have used a different model for the super treasure hunt for this case. But they did a good job with it. They did make it look good. Uh, this one uh, features uh, the, I think these are the beadlock. Uh, off-road wheels the super treasure hunt model of course has real real riders their chrome deep dish real riders so they have the real uh, rubber tires on them and uh, the paint on this is kind of a just like a true blue whereas the paint on the super treasure hunt is more of a uh, deeper specter flame blue at least on the blue portion that's on the back. The green on the front is pretty much the same on both of them. Uh, but this is an off-road racer or a Baja racer. You notice the spare tire there in the back. Um, so, you know, in case something happens during your race, you can always go and, and change it out. Uh, the spare tire on the back would have liked to have seen a little bit more detail on it, especially on the Super Treasure Hunt series. How cool would that be if the uh, the spare tire on the back was also a real rider? I think that would be a really nice touch to that one. Um, but I believe the one on the Super Treasure Hunt is just the same as that one. It's just kind of a, a blank, uh, black, all black, uh, non-functional wheel that they put back there. Uh, this was Sporting Falcon Graphics. It is from the Speed Graphics series. Uh, so this one is representing Falcon in that uh, same uh, paint scheme that we've been used to. And uh, there it is on the front as well. And it's got the number 873 up on the top. And there's another look from the other side. We'll zoom in a little bit, let you see some of the detail here. This one's riding up pretty high. And this is based on a 1990s Toyota Tundra. Uh, so this, this model's been out for a while, uh, since 2000 and, two, or I think just since the year 2000. I believe that's when it first was released. Uh, so it has been out for a while and uh, it is an older Toyota truck. There's a lot of detail in the back here. Not sure what that is uh, right there. It looks like almost some type of exhaust system. Uh, so I don't know if that's exhaust back there or what, but you do see some detail back there and uh, right there where the bed would be. Inside, it's got a roll cage So you can see it from that angle as well. Let's recenter them right there. There you go. So that's the Toyota off-road truck. This is the regular version. And like I said, this uh, if, if you're lucky enough to find this with the real rider tires and the uh, the Spectre Flame paint, that little bit different color on the back that darker shade of blue then you have found yourself a super treasure hunt and uh, the regular version of this one uh, the one that I'm holding here 
is uh, retailing for well retailing for about a dollar but uh, secondary market you can find it for uh, as much as two dollars the super treasure hunt version is currently going for 25 to 30 dollars uh, so it's pretty hot on the secondary market right now but there you go the Toyota off-road truck thank you for watching